Hey up everyone, right, so whatever, this fallout thing with my daughter or what, what, what however you want to categorise it or whatever, whatever's just happened. Like, whatever, so basically I just got this massive fucking text message from Zara's mum, who's like the subject of the video or whatever. And like, whatever, she's basically saying that she ain't got a problem with the video and stuff. Because yeah, I'm basically, I'm not telling, I'm not telling truth. I haven't said anything that's not true in those videos. She did do those things. She did cheat on me. She did steal from me. She did lie to me. Well, she did all of those things. I'm not making it up. Why would I do that? I didn't even know they were ever going to see these videos. Do you know what I mean? I, I never even thought in a million years, oh yeah, my daughter might see this video. Whatever. It was as if that was ever in my head when I was making it. Do you know what I mean? I never even thought about it. No, I've got shitloads of people on Facebook who all know about all this shit. <laughs> whatever, whatever, whatever. So, anyway, so I get this text message from her, whatever. And she's saying that she's trying to explain it to Zara, but, but she says that Zara's really upset with me and stuff, and she wants me to delete the videos. Well, she never said that. She never said that she wanted me to delete them or anything like that. Whatever, maybe I should have just read read between the lines or something, but whatever, I don't care whether that video's up or not, so whatever, so I've just deleted them all, right, if she wants me to delete them, I'll delete them, whatever, if my daughter doesn't want me to have that video up, then I'll take it down, do you know what I mean, I'm not bothered about it, I'm more bothered about not upsetting her than anything else, I don't want her to be upset, man, why would I want that, I want her to be happy, that's all I've ever wanted for her, I don't want to fall out with her. She's my little girl. I don't want to fall out with her. So whatever. So Jewel said to me that I should unblock her on Facebook. And she says, right, she says, the only way you're going to get it sorted out. But whatever, as far as I was concerned, there anything to sort out. You just said you don't want anything to do with me. What can I, what can I do I'm in that situation? Do you know what I mean? It doesn't seem like there's any way up. And I said, can we move on from this? I was like, look, I don't think we're going to agree on this. Can we move on? She said, no. So what am I supposed to say to that? I have to respect what she wants. And if she don't want to talk to me, then I have to respect that. I can't. I'm not going to force myself on somebody else. I'm a fucking anarchist. I don't do shit like that. I have to respect what she's feeling and what she, what she thinks about me and stuff. I want to fall out with her. So, so I've unblocked her. And I sent her a message, basically. Whatever, just saying I don't want to fall out with her and stuff. And... I've, I've deleted the videos and whatever, right? But whatever, it's like one o'clock in the morning, so she's clearly asleep. I'll have to wait until morning to find out what happens and what her response is and stuff. But, I don't know. I hope we can get through it and whatever. It'd be awesome to reconnect with them and find out what they've been doing and who they've become. She might even be a Tory, do you know what I mean? I might hate her. I might not like her, but it'd be awesome to find out. I've been looking at her Facebook. She seems pretty cool. She seems a cool girl. She's so ridiculously pretty. <laughs> she was really pretty when she was younger. I remember saying to her when she was younger, because she used to use the fact that she was pretty and cute and stuff, and I used to her, look, don't rely on that. Don't rely on your look. Right, because when you get older, your looks are going to go away. And if that's all you've got is your looks, then you haven't got anything. And you're going to be devastated and you're going to be depressed and everything. Once those looks start going away, what you want is a personality and an intelligence and stuff. Those things don't fade as you get older. I remember saying this to Zara all the time. So it'll be interesting to see whether she's one of those girls who just uses her looks to get away, to get by with whatever thing. And she's got no smarts or whatever. <laughs> I don't know, she was intelligent as a kid, she wasn't fake at all, she was intelligent, she she, she couldn't be asked. she didn't, whatever, any ask, I don't know. See, somebody on Facebook said that, I, said, I shouldn't talk about the kids on year, but like, whatever, they were a massive part of my life, I loved them to bits, why shouldn't I talk about them? 
oh, why does my life never go in a straight line? I've said this before, and I, it just, everything's going fine, and all of a sudden some shit just falls out of the fucking sky, lands in my fucking lap, and now I've got to deal with this. Do you know what I mean? Like, whatever, whatever. I fucking fantasised about meeting the kids, do you know what I mean? I thought oh, I might bump into them in a pub or in a nightclub or something or whatever. Like, I don't know. I certainly didn't think, yeah, I might talk to her on Facebook. She tells me she doesn't want anything to do with me. <laughs> didn't, didn't think that would ever happen. So, yeah, now I just have to see what happens. But hopefully, hopefully it gets hard out.